Alright everyone, Buzzer46 here, hopping on to the Brawl commentary. Finally. <laughs> been uh, fairly busy, so I haven't been able to get on. Anyways, uh, game one uh, did go to Citato, so of uh, Losers Finals here. Going on to game two here. Uh, Citato currently down. A decent option to go the one two. Um, I'm not sure he meant to do the third one, however. Uh, Satato not given any punish. Though, uh, now the Tori's in a fairly bad position. Oh, gets the grab. Tries to go for the uh, Thundercats, but does not quite get it. Uh, Marth being a fairly heavy character. Uh, not dying from the up smash, however, he is able to come back get the Dolphin Slash for the kill. Double Dancing Blade, adding on some decent percent here. Landing the third one. Stato just not really expecting it. Interesting little trade there, but... Uh, Tori tried to go for a forward smash, but Zelda's down smash a little faster and was able to hit Tori first. with the up smash. Tori's just doing a very good job here. I'm just playing patient, punishing all of Satato's approaches. Potato's done a very good job here, turning this around to his advantage. He's knocked Tori off stage. He's been keeping the off stage pressure. Tori finally able though to uh, land a back air. Potato though just looking for really one good solid hit from either forward air, back air, or even a smash attack to finish this off. Throwing out the dancing blade. Potato uh, trying to spot dodge, of course. Spot dodge only dodges one, maybe two swings. Does get the down smash for the kill. Tori now is keeping Potato in a bad position. Sue so, stuck on stage, uh, off stage. Tori's just using a lot of dancing blades. Uh, missed his punish there though, and it's now Potato's turn to punish. He's come in fairly strong. Another fancy blade for Tori. Potato's getting caught by almost all of those. Falls right into that uh, shield breaker. Very good. Wait, uh, read there by Tori. And the up tilt. So, Tori taking game two. He hit you with the tipper back end. Okay. Alright. Stato opting to go to FD. Uh... A little bit less room for uh, Tori to be able to maneuver around. Or, which I mean... Actually, it's a decent, decent thing for this matchup here. Where, But yeah, Tori's actually doing, still doing a really good job using a lot of dancing blades. Just keeping that pressure on. Potato. Nice. One Tori after right uh, swung twice through with the spot dodge, and Stato was able, able to get a down smash in there before the third hit came out. Stato. Fairly, really in a percent. Doing very good job surviving by both these characters. Got went in for the sliding up smash, but missing it. Stay was able to get a nice, solid uh, sweet spot back here. Dolphin Slash, though, finishing off that stock. We're back at 0 0. Oh, 
Oh, Potato catching that, uh, reading that roll there with an up smash. Tori's just really heavily relying on his uh, dancing blade here. Barely missing that ass smash. Taylor able to grab ledge just in time to get the iframes. Taylor often can just use fireballs for uh, pressure. Oh! That explosion catching him. Tori kind of confused as to what was happening. <laughs> Alright, once again with the dance blade, Stato's not noticing that Tori's loving this. Potatoes, all right. Yeah, no, it's, uh, every time Potato approaches, uh, oh, oh my gosh, the trade. Tori barely able to survive with good DI and momentum canceling. The uh, fireball uh, hitting Tori and Tori too low. Potato saving him. Down smash again. Oh, and the S-Mash, not enough. Going from one side of the stage to the other. However, Tori's sitting in a very precarious situation. Oh, the counter. Potato off stage now. Tori doing a very good job, waiting patiently, trying to bait out air dodges and get punishes. Standing back right there in a the position to where he could, if he wanted to, dance a blade to just force Potato off. In the back throw, oh, the momentum cancel and DI, very good. Ooh. Oh, the dash attack! Dash attack getting just below us with, with Zelda leaning forward, getting just below that fair, catching Marth and taking him off the top. Game three going to Cetato. What's that? Carl really taking the moment. Um, recom uh, recomposing, deciding where does he want to go. And it looks like we are going to castle. Back in here. Tori struggling. Struggling a little bit now. He's really trying to just keep the pressure on. Potato opting to kind of play around the statues. Tori not respecting the fact that the statues extend to her box. The hitbox, excuse me. Ooh, 
potato spot dodging this third swing of it and getting the down smash and catching him. Potato's really doing a good job here, just keeping the pressure on. Tori has not been, not quite been respecting some of the hitboxes that Zelda can throw out. Very nice, solid S smash. However, it was just being so low that it. Even if it adds quite a bit, the trip, giving uh, Tori a chance. SDIing out of it. And the Dolphin Slash. Very good option there. Sutato coming in with a back air. And the Dolphin Slash, of course, very fast, high priority, coming right through and taking out the stock. And a very quick uh, turnaround on percentage here. Potato now down from a decent lead. And Tori's doing a very good job just playing patient. Ooh, that up smash risky. That one even riskier. And the Dolphin Slash. Potato, uh, good DI. Coming straight up and up the skirt it goes! Game 4 going to, game, going to Tori. We are now 2-2. Citato's pick on the stage. Whew. Tori after kind of have... Really letting his just frustration out. Finally started finding his stride after he was able to get that nice dolphin slash kill. After that, he just found his stride. Sutato quickly put Sutato in a heavy pressure situation. And then... And then let Sutato get out of it. Coming to Halberd now. Tori looking much better this game already. Looks like he's finally got his composure back from the uh, frustration of what's been happening the last couple games. So Tato getting forward smash off. Nice running up smash. Oh, that was a very uh, testing situation there. <laughs> All right, Tori got Tato back off the stage. Tori. Oh, Tato going, recovering just not the right spot. Yeah, put himself in a really bad. So, Tori not having his jump there. Uh, apparently, as soon as Sutato uh, hit him, Tori jumped, but he hit the stage, canceling his jump. And in a tumble situation, so it didn't actually recover his jump for him, and he fell off without the jump. But Tori now turning this right back around, put Sutato right on the ledge, has just been shuffled. Shutting down every single effort Sotato had to recover. Sotato finally able to get back on only after taking a very large amount of damage. Oh.
Ah, uh, that's why did I missed it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Solo commentating. Not always the easiest thing to do, of course. But Tori has turned us around. That fair. Oh. With the back air on shield, Tori able to get a dancing blade out. Misses his forward smash. Oh, both players missing their attacks. Trip comes in, saving Sutato from that one attack. Tori really looking to just finish this right here, right now. And... <laughs> Tori up smashing, missing, able to perfect shield. Oh! Potato, very bad situation here. Playing it very patient. Trying to bait anything out. See, trying to see what Tori will do. But Tori also playing patient. Potato dropping too far low. And making it Tori's set of 3-2. Tori now going to be facing...